Hey YouTube, so I'm coming to you guys real quick. Um, I actually just tried out Keisha Charmaine's No Gel, No Pins retwist. And um, okay, it was a little hard for me, let me say. It was a little hard for me because I'm just so used to using different products. I, I Instead of trying to just cut out every product in total, I'm like, okay, maybe I should just put the oil in and then just retwist. But once you start... Saying once I started thinking away, right, I'll just put the oil and I'm like, okay, I'll just grease my scalp too. I won't use any gel, but then like that, I'm like, and then I finally was like, <laughs> I'm just gonna have to do it the normal way because I usually do pipe cleaners or um, what's it called, the braid out, but um, and I'm thinking like I don't like my hair straight. Like I want to do something, and if I do any of I well. I just feel like they go hand in hand. If I do a style like that, like pipe cleaner curls or braid out, you know, I have to include those products. So I'm like, you know, I'm just making it too complicated than it needs to be. It's supposed to be really simple, just water and retwisting. So finally, I was just like, that's it. Like, I'm just going to put do the coconut oil. That's it. And I'm just going to retwist like that. And I did. I did have to use the spray bottle a couple times because my hair dried out. And, um... I thought of, you know, the bright side while I was doing it, you know, even though I wasn't doing pipe cleaners or a braid out, I just said, you know, I could do a link check. So let me think. Okay, so I've been locked for a year and eight months so far. <laughs> See, but I'm happy with my length. This is what I was talking to you guys before about, like, it's, I feel like it's at an awkward length right now. It's, like, not long, but not short. It's just, like, what am I supposed to do with this? I feel like it just looks like, I, you know, like it's blunt, like it's cut blunt. I hate blunt cuts, and that's how I feel like my hair looks right now. Like, it, like I have a bad haircut. Like, that's what I like now. And you know, I'm not really used to this. I haven't worn my hair, I haven't seen my hair straight in months, probably about a year. Because I've been doing that debris outs for so long, and then I started with the pipe cleaners, and I, yeah, I haven't seen my hair straight in probably about a year. But you know, it, I did let me say though, back to trying her method. I do like the way it came out. I don't feel like, you know, I feel like I can go without products. I feel like it's a tight, secure retwist. I'm moving it, well, I said under the dryer. I'm, I can't remember if in her video she sat under the dryer, but I sat under the dryer for an hour, so my hair is fully dry, and I like feeling like it's secure. I can leave it down like this, not worry that it's gonna unravel. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really liking it. Like, I, I could definitely see myself going this way using just coconut oil and maybe, you know, grease my scalp. But definitely, because I sat in the dryer so long, I'm definitely to put more coconut oil in just to replenish my scalp from all that heat. But yeah, I really like the method. Oh, I didn't time myself, but it definitely killed so much time because remember I don't only retwist I usually do pipe cleaners or a braid out and it just went so much faster just all I have to do is twist and leave it twist and leave it twist and leave it and I, have to, I didn't have to twist it then wrap it around the pipe cleaner and make sure it's secure and have my head all tight like that's the thing it feels secure but it's not tight it's not like I'm you know just got bow ties or something I'm really happy with it my hair feels light and fluffy and doesn't feel greasy. I'm really, I really like this method. I definitely think that you should try it. Actually, though, I think, well, I mean, you know, go ahead and try it if you have new, younger locks. But I think this is more for semi, because my locks aren't mature. Like, I would say they're semi, you know, they're only a year and eight months old. Um, yeah, semi, uh, semi mature to mature locks because baby locks they kind of 
do their own thing. But when you get mature lots, they kind of, you know, finally get with the program, you know? Like, just like when you have a teenager and they come through to adulthood and when they're a teenager, can't control them. As adults, they finally get it, you know, when you're lots of older, your strands finally are cooperating and they stick with, this, with the lock that they know. You know, baby locks like to visit neighboring locks. So um, I would definitely say you might need a little bit of product when you have baby locks just to give your hair a good hold because you're in a stage right now where your hair is doing what it wants. But um, other than that, yeah, I would definitely, I can't remember if she used any product at all, or like oil or anything. But I would recommend using at least that, at least oil. Just That's all I did, just put some oil on my hands, rub, ran it through my hair, and resist it just like that. Like, I didn't even sit there and get technical, make sure every lock got a little bit of oil. I just did a quick run through, and I'm about to do another one again, just run it through, and then tie my hair up for the night. I think it's a, see this fuzzy lock? Like, it's shaped like a little, um... What's it called? The arrowhead? It's like a funny shape, it's, and I can't unfrizz it. I cannot. No matter how many times, I remember I seen Chesita lock. She like just rubbed her locks together. Maybe she, you know, I don't really remember the video, it was a while ago. Maybe she does that on a daily basis for it to get stuck together. Because it don't stay, you know. Now it's looking a little neater, but then, you know, come tomorrow, it'll back to, go back to being crazy. I don't know, but yeah, um, that's all I can say, you guys, and I know y'all mad, because I didn't come back with the outfit of the day, but let me tell you, my day was crazy, like, that Friday was crazy, but I'm back now, just to give you a a shout out, thanks for the new method, um, and I'll see you guys later, next time. <laughs>